Hi, YouTube. <clears throat> um, today, I don't really have a topic, but it's just like a vent. But, yeah. So, today's Valentine's Day. <laughs> and I am single. I'm still... <clears throat> I did have a Valentine, but that was my ex. <laughs> um, but yeah, I don't really know the reason why I'm telling you this, but I did want to become more authentic with with myself and I mean with everyone else. I just want to be be myself around other people and just say things that I want to talk about. And not worry what other people might think or see me. And that's a good practice. <laughs> but anyways, <clears throat> a few things I noticed is um, I never really liked Valentine's Day. It just seemed too, I guess, cringy. And like, it feels like people show off their love to their partner or maybe that's how i see it i've seen a lot of posts that they're just very grateful for their partner and i think that's a very nice thing but uh i don't think there should be a day where it specifies how much you appreciate the person maybe it's a good reminder for the people because i can i can definitely see that yeah, but I feel like you have, you don't have, well, it's hard to appreciate your partner every day. And Valentine's does give you like a small reminder of, oh, why are you with this person? And why are you enjoying this? Or wh why you have so much love for your partner? I just counter my argument <laughs> but yeah <clears throat> mm. yeah I just don't like the aspect of people almost expecting something from Valentine's Day which it makes sense it's like you that's the day you pre show your appreciation for your partner but i don't think the physical uh like physical things that you give to your partner like flowers chocolate candy uh something like presents i think it is really nice but it doesn't become very special when you expect ex expect from your partner because you're filled with that hope of getting the present you get countered with disappointment which sometimes happens and instead of being something making a positive thing about this day it becomes negative so that's why it depends on the people or your point of view on the Valentine's Day because yeah I guess it just depends on the person and a lot of people see as Valentine's as a bad thing when you're single because it just reminds you of how lonely you are or that you're single but yeah I just, you can start appreciating people that you have in your life. It could be your friend, your family, and yourself. <laughs> so, yeah, just give some love for yourself, to yourself, because you deserve it. I know sometimes it feels like you don't deserve it, but do something 
to something that you will love yourself about because the more things you do that you know you should do the more you're gonna love yourself and i learned it many different times where i hated myself and i hated how i feel or i hated my body and after i started doing things that i needed to do that's when you start to love yourself because you know you gotta be the best version of yourself so yeah this video i don't know where it was going but just random thoughts that i was popping up in my head i do like freestyling because it feels more genuine it feels like a conversation uh instead of the script but also it's good to have a script to stay on topic <laughs> but yeah i do like a genuine conversation and that's why i try to be on my point like I, back in my head like i remember what i want to talk about but also i just say what i feel so and i think i'm getting better at it <laughs> hopefully so yeah hopefully you had a good valentine's day i know it might be if you might be alone i hope you treated yourself well i hope you didn't feel the negativity around it and i know it's the, the end of the day of the valentine's it's not it's already like past valentine's day but i guess that's like my reflection of the valentine's day that i had and maybe some will need it for the future so thank you guys for watching and i hope you will be your own valentine <laughs>